Does anybody know what time it is? I do. Archery season 2020. Let's go take a look at two of my favorite tools when field dressing your deer. Welcome back and thanks for joining Ty the Gun Guy. I want to show you guys Blackbeard Fire at blackbeardfire.com. Use my coupon code TOD, T O D D 10, for your 10% discount. Cut a little piece right here. Mix it up a little bit. I'll use a lighter. There you go. Instant fire. You could also take your fire stick for survival. There you go. Blackbeardfire.com. Check it out. Todd 10. T O D D 10 for your 10% discount. Thanks. Two tools, absolute must in the field. If you're a deer hunter, big game hunter, these are two tools that you absolutely must have in your pack to field dress your game. Let's go take a look. So the two items as an absolute must, first is your Gerber. This is the uh, bone saw, right? It's light and we're going to get into it a little bit, but you got to have the bone saw. Secondly, you got to have the outdoor edge swing blade. We're going to get into that too. These two items right here is all you need in a field. Now, I haven't done any elk or bear or any super large uh, mule deer or moose, but uh, as far as white-tailed deer are concerned, this will get it done every day, all day. All right, let's talk about the outdoor edge swing blade first, okay? It comes in a sheet, right? It's got a nice holder. It's a heavy-duty Cordura, and it's actually, it's got a plastic case inside of the actual cordura so it's actually doubled up in there for protection you can see the plastic here it's a liner that goes down into the inside before we take it all the way out and discuss i want you to listen you guys hear that so this actually clicks clicks into place and has the button here as well so you've got a button to hold it in and it actually is retention um inside the holster itself so pull this thing out so there you see it it is called the swing blade and i do think they have it in hunter orange now uh that way if you drop it on the ground that uh, it's going to be easier to find got a nice rubber handle to it nice feel it's very light i'll see if i can find the weight and the specifications but it's a soft rubber so you have an awesome grip if your hands get wet in the snow or water it's got a nice finger groove right here so your finger fits in it nice it's got some serrations on the top edge so when you're putting pressure down your hands not going to slip off so it just is a really nice overall feel and i think it's very safe as far as that goes very solid when it locks into place why do they call this thing a swing blade it's got a button right here so instead of holding it like this like a normal knife pressing the button to close it you can't do that because the actual blade will get in the way of your hand so you actually want to go from this angle press the button and lift up lift the blade so now you've actually got the gut hook right so it's a swing blade one side is the regular blade the other side is the actual gut hook it is all one solid stainless construction so this is a two-in-one tool for every deer hunter. I mean, it's an absolute must. It's just under 70 bucks. It keeps a sharp edge, and it washes up and maintains very easily. Absolutely fantastic. I mean, you got to have it. All right, when I field dress the deer, I actually start with the hole in the front, and then I'll come, and I will flip it, and I will use the gut hook and uh, get inside there and zip it right up to the... Uh, the throat area that way you're not going to hit any of the uh, internals so it's two in one absolutely fantastic tool that you must have in my book secondly is the gerber the gerber bone saw again this thing is super light orange sheet orange handle and uh, it's easy to see if you drop it but this thing is super light it's got about the same type of rubber it's got the same type of soft rubber as the swing blade so you can get a really nice grip when that thing is wet. Your hands are cold. That's going to give you absolutely fantastic. It's got some ribs on the top here. And uh, it's got a little finger groove there. Finger groove here so you can really be safe. Your thumb. It's got a thumb 
rest here so when you're sawing right there it's absolutely safe you're not going to slip and cut your finger so i'm sure you guys know what this is this is a bone saw so when you get down to the pelvic area there's always going to be the pelvis bone that you got to split and some people use an axe some people use a knife with the hammer or an axe split it down the center you're good to go what i like to do is i cut on each side right and left with the bone saw it's got a dull flat edge here with a hook so when you are sawing, it's not going to hit any of the innards. You're not going to hit the urine sac or the glands or anything like that. So it's dull and has a hook here for a reason. It also has this hook here. It's more of a stopper. When you're coming up with the blade, it's actually going to stop and hit the bone. So it's not going to come all the way out. So I believe that's more of a safety feature right there. You could also use this thing for the breastplate, the rib cage coming up through. Once you use your gut hook to get this thing in, you actually come in and you can go backwards up and use that for your rib cage as well coming up. Light and thin, but it's still, you can see it's not really bending. It's pretty thin, but it's not flimsy. So I'll look the price of this thing up. I believe this thing has got to be under 20 bucks or in about that range. But there you go. That is for your bone saw. If you're a deer hunter, big game hunter, and you have not tried the Outdoor Edge Swing Blade, you absolutely have to try it. And don't forget the Gerber bone saw here. And uh, I know a lot of people use the, uh, the butt plug, but um, sometimes I don't like that because it will actually tear the liner, the intestines, and then you've got a mess. So I open them up and get in there with the bone saw. Use my gut hook and the knife to cut out what you have to cut out and you move on. So two fantastic tools if you're a whitetail deer hunter. I do want to mention about Olight. You guys use my coupon code TOD10, that's T-O-D-D-1-0, and you guys will get a 10% discount on your Olight products. If you guys like my videos, I appreciate the support. Go ahead and click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell notifications to let you know when I'm dropping new videos. Try to stay up on the latest, stay healthy, stay vigilant, and until next time, tie the gun guy!